Hello! I'm alive and well, and we are back to the regularly scheduled content. I'm on day six, I think, of being sick. Definitely more towards heels now, but still like congestion and stuff is making my voice sound funny, so. It's Tuesday, I'm gonna bring you guys along for half of the week, I guess. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, there's some fun stuff every single day this week. Right now, it's late into the afternoon, it's like five o'clock and i'm gonna try to pull myself together to actually leave the house for once in the last week um, i'm gonna go get a pedicure with my mom and grandma you guys i have not driven my car in a week a full week this feels weird and up until last night i hadn't really left the house in a week either i was just so down in the dumps yesterday by like midday i was going crazy just from not leaving the house and you know just i don't know it was like real quarantine all over again i was so sad i was crying over everything zachary the sweetest man i've ever known he took me to walmart and we walked around and he made it fun and it just felt so good to get out of the house and i could not be more thankful for him he's the sweetest man in the world i'm very excited to be out again but on my own and driving myself seeing my mom and my grandma for anyone who's concerned Today is my day six of symptoms, and according to the CDC, you only have to wait five days. So, we're in the clear there. Here's my outfit for the day. I feel so cute today. I just wanted to like go big. We're going to my brother's graduation. So I have this little, I don't even know what you'd call this. I got it from Goodwill, I think. <laughs> These pants are from Shein from a few years back. And then I have heels on. Honestly, I think these might be from Shein too. I don't remember. So cute. And I straightened my hair, which I never do anymore. I either curl it or leave it natural, but straight just kind of like went with the vibe my food's gonna about to catch on fire <laughs> my brother graduates from high school today crazy me and my brother are just about seven years apart and it's just the two of us so it's quite a big gap so every time he has like a major milestone i'm like oh my gosh that was me seven years ago insane i absolutely love my pedicure they did such a good job looking so cute in these shoes i'm feeling like a new woman today i still sound so stuffed up but i'm feeling 10 times better than even just yesterday this ear is a little bit plugged up so i'm kind of working on drinking water and stuff to like loosen that and get that fixed but other than that i'm excited it's gonna be a good day Thursday. I'm just sitting down to have a little bit of lunch some tacos before I head back to work It's my first day back at work in almost two weeks crazy. I kind of forgot. I had a job Honestly, it's a whirlwind to be off for two weeks, but not be like traveling, you know I'm still here in town. So super funky still not 100% but I've been taking some more medications and really trying to get back to normal I lost my taste yesterday and I've been sick for a week now and I just now have lost my taste so that's been super weird first time I ever had COVID um, I never lost my taste it's been really really weird trying to eat something and expecting like oh this is gonna be so good and then I take a bite and I'm like oh what like eggs this morning was disgusting imagine eating an egg with no flavor and you just get the texture. It was disgusting. Zachary started feeling sick yesterday, so <laughs> I'm trying so hard to help him feel better so that he doesn't feel like crap on our trip. He's already decided that he is going on this trip no matter what. So I have this cute little area set up for him. He's gonna be home soon, but we're gonna miss each other with me leaving and him coming home. So a Mucinex, he's been taking these. 
um, some cough drops. I got him a little liquid IV, the um, vitamin C orange one set up here. And then I'm gonna lay out like the blanket and pillows so he has somewhere to come take a nap after work. But yeah, it's like everyone that we know is getting sick now and it's just crazy that it's, I feel like it's a weird time of year for like sickness to be going around, you know, like late spring, early summer, but that's my update and I've got work soon. Did you really sleep good if your shorts aren't completely turned? <laughs> Gonna try out this new body wash today too. It's cucumber mint. I always, always, always try to get the bedding washed before we leave so that we can come home to clean bedding. That's my number one favorite traveling tip. Update on how I'm feeling today. Even better than the day before. It seems like we're consecutively getting better, which is amazing. I made it through a five hour work shift last night with no problems. It was great. And this morning, I definitely feel like I have more energy than all of the other days. Zachary's doing okay. <laughs> he came home and slept for four hours yesterday right after work. Then I made him get up, take a shower, eat some food, and he went right back to sleep. So good for him. He's at work this morning, and he's going to work just for a few hours, and then we're going to head out. So everything is a-okay for right now. We're going to Utah. We're going to Utah. Let's pack. I don't think we need the suitcase this size. I might pull a smaller one out for the two of us to share for three days. I feel like it's not that bad. Yeah, this size is definitely better. I'm very much an overpacker. And so is Zachary. I haven't even begun to think about outfits, so now's the hard part. But thank goodness Zachary did his last night. All his stuff is ready to go. I'm just gonna stick it in the suitcase for him. And I know I for sure wanna pack my book. All right, let's pack up and go. <laughs> no, but really I have a lot more to do than I realized and it's kind of like later in the day than I realized. So I'm gonna end this vlog so I can get everything put together and then start our travel vlog. So I hope you enjoyed this one and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.